President of the Jamaica Touch Football Association, Evan Davis, has expressed optimism that American football will grow in participation locally as a result of Matt Peart and Neville Gallimore being drafted to NFL franchises on Friday. Simon Preston has the details. Six foot seven inch offensive tackle Matt Peart was selected by four time Super Bowl winners, the New York Giants, as the number 99 pick in the 2020 NFL draft. Peart, who was selected out of the University of Connecticut, was the 35th pick of the third round. The 22 year old now joins countrymen Patrick Chung. Daniel Hunter and Corey Ballantyne in the league. Peart describes the opportunity as a dream come true. It's always been a dream of mine. Uh, like I said, just growing up in the tri-state area, um, you know, just, you know, I've been a Giants fan since I moved to New York. <laughs> uh, so it's always been a dream. And uh, things I want to work on, just, um, you know, just overall just becoming a better student of the game and, um, you know, just fine-tuning everything when regards to coming to technique, um, you know, being um, that much more dominant as an offensive lineman, uh, working on, uh, you know, uh, footwork, um, uh, hand placement, the, everything. Just, just, just everything I need to do to become a dominant player. Meanwhile, five-time Super Bowl winners, the Dallas Cowboys, selected six-foot-two-inch defensive tackle Neville Gallimore. Gallimore, who was born in Canada, was born to Jamaican parents and spent his early years on the island before heading to North America. The University of Oklahoma man was the 82nd pick overall in the draft and was number 18 in the third round. President of the Jamaica Touch Football Association, Evan Davis, reacted to the draft. This is a great accomplishment as it further shows that world-class athletes come from Jamaica. Davis also expects the sports to gather momentum locally with Peart and Gallimore signing with NFL teams. We anticipate that this will increase the participation and interest in our American Football League here in Jamaica. It provides proof that the path is real, that hard work and dedication pays off with a chance to play in the NFL. Defensive tackle Javon Kinlaw was the highest drafted Caribbean player on Friday as the Trinidadian was drafted to the San Francisco 49ers as the number 14 pick of round one. Quarterback Joe Burrow was the number one draft pick to the Cincinnati Bengals from Louisiana State University. The draft this year was held online due to the COVID-19 pandemic. The 2020 season of the NFL is expected to kick off on September 10. Simon Preston reporting for TVJ Sports.